yesterday's body count lottery rounded out to a solid and sturdy 30. 10 out of Haywood. Thanks to unabated gang wars. One officer down, so I guess you're all...
me in the car.
I'll take the wheel. Sure, sure. Lead the driving to the pros. isn't she? Dreamy indeed. No surprise you wanted her back. She completes me. See? Managed just fine without Mitch and Scorpion. Listen, V, it's not over yet. It's not? You got the cargo, you got your car. I did not get Nash, who was not in Rocky Ridge. The fucker didn't show. Listen, I have a plan. And I don't care. The car and the merch, that's what we were after. We got them. Six Street away for it. Listen to I... me, for fuck's sake. I know where their little hidey hole is. We'll take the old unfinished freeway nearby. They will not be expecting us. I'm sure of it. The Nash Hunt wasn't part of our deal. Only because I thought he would show up in Rocky Ridge. But he didn't. Might not even be in their hideout. I know he's there, V. That fucking Raffin cheated me. I can't just let it go. I can't. Do you really not understand that? <sighs> All right. So where's this hideout? A hop and skip away. Thanks, V. What Nash did. I placed my trust in him. He was the first person I worked with after leaving the Alda Caldos. After I came to Night City. And I granted him my trust. I get it. I know how you feel. Had someone betray me just like that once. And did you make them pay? Never got the chance. Someone else got to him first. But if they had it? Would you have done it? No doubt. Without skipping a beat. Let's get this over with. Are you ready? Let's get him. Stay right where you are.
your own problems, clean up your shit, Nash is dead. One shit cleaned. Happy? And the six came lunch? Nash can't deliver it anymore. But if you ask nicely, I might be able to help. Help me? I take my cut up for... So, feel any better? Maybe a little. Let's get out of here.
one bit her cold bitch that broke. Think she might have lost the plot. Mean to say she used to be sweet and alluring? Huh. <laughs> Never that. But she's no stranger to the other end of the stick. Think she might need a nice strong shock. Hey, boss. Got your cargo. No, no fast ones. Come on, let's meet. Sunset Motel. I know you're not kidding. I'm certain to be there. Okay, I arranged our meeting. Let's do the deal and start working on Hellman. Agreed? Sunset Motel? What's that? A safe spot. It's not far from here. Sixth Street not likely to pull anything. I've driven for them before. Never had them do anything strange. I'm hoping they know what's good for business. Should be fun. They're here. Let me do the talking. Sensing trouble? No. At least I don't think so. I find it paying to get sideways. Hey, boss. Panna! How's Nash? Didn't seem to be answering his phone. Don't call him anymore. There's no need. <laughs> you got balls, girl. What's this? A bonus of some sort? Just here to keep you in line. Ooh, got a little more sass than Nash, do you? Wait and see. <laughs> I like this one. There. First class merch. Mm hmm. So, everything's in order? Check your account. Should be pretty plush in a couple of minutes. It's been a pleasure. But I believe Rogue's the one who is to pay me. You're all right. Think you earned a tip. Let's roll. That went well. Come on, let's get a drink. Yeah? What's up in the big world? Now that I think about it, you don't have Vinci PD bothering your way out of here. No corpo supply inspections either. You got anything unconventional that I wouldn't find in the city? I'm sure we can find you something. What are you carrying? Firearms. Best in all the Badlands.
¡Hola! Raffin's wiped, six streets pleased. Pretty good day for Pan Am Palmer. The day's not over yet. You still have a chance to piss me off. <coughs> oh, I, I can't. Hello, Noah. Hey, new biz or new friends back there? Take a wild guess. Is everything good with you? Do those bozos come around again? Raffins? Nah, it's been quiet. They'll be back, sure enough. This place has seen worse. What can I get you? Brosif. Two of them. So that package for Street. What was it? You didn't peek? Valoperidol. Drugs for the cyber psychos in our midst. They trade in them? Yes. They have deals. With black clinics, rippers. Well, here's to that thorn of yours. Thanks for everything, partner. Another one over here. Thanks, Noah. Cheers. Let me know if you need anything else. Raffins. We done with them? Oh no. The shiver cockroaches. One's never rid of them. But it should be quiet for a time. They'll need to gather their wits and dust themselves off. The Alda Caldas. Think he'll ever go back? I mean, not right now, but someday? I don't rightly know. On the one hand, I don't have anyone outside the clan. Shit, I don't really know any other life. But on the other? Without my clan, who am I? Who would I become if I stayed in Night City? Could just start over again. That's what I did. Mm-hmm. For now, I only seem to be really good at burning bridges. Talking about Rogue? No. But thanks for reminding me. V. Do you think I can make a fresh start with her, too? She seems to better at ease on the right people. You'll work it out. All right. Time we look to my needs. What's the plan for Hellman? I've come up with a plan. A first draft. But I need to sleep on it. Work it out. Then we can talk about the details. I think it best to rent rooms here. Just to stay in the area. We'll get to work around midnight. It'll help keep us out of sight. Agreed? Good idea. Let's do it. Noah, we'll take two rooms. Just for tonight. I'll go catch a few winks. See you later.
आंखें खोल के कौन सोता है भाई What do I say? Huh? Look, uh, I I'm waiting for a friend. What's up? <sighs> Watch your own self! Mm. It's all a shitstorm anyway. What's your problem? The problem is what you are holding. <laughs> uh. That invisible thing. What's up? Guys, okay. Oh, hey there. Staring is rude. You know that, right? Whoa, whoa, wow. This is my room. My name is Dakota Smith. If you're looking for jobs out here, you will find them with me. Name's V. Thanks for the intel. Things flow differently out here. Keep your head on, city kid. Hey. Hello. I'm just checking the suspension. The hydraulics have to be ship shape. We're in for a bumpy ride. Did you sleep all right? Can't complain. And you? Reasonably rested? I think you had nightmares. You screamed a few times. Really? Don't worry. I'm accustomed to that sort of thing. When Mitch and Scorpion came back from the war, they tossed and turned night after night. For months this went on. Whatever it is, it'll pass. Yeah, let's hope so. Come up with anything? For Hellman, I mean. As a matter of fact, I did. Look here. Okay, tell me. We're the wrench. The cutter is the AV. And the screwdriver is where the AV should bury its nose cone in the dust. Now, you must be wondering how we get the AV to do that. That old HMG of yours. My gun will be useful elsewhere. This caliber would barely dent the armor of a heavy hitter like that. There are other ways. Here, the clamps are solution. A Satwave power station. Um, Satwave power station? Yes. We need to break into it. Mm hmm So far, so good. But then what? And then we strike. We hit the AV with an EMP. Of course we do. 
As soon as the AV is in range, we cause an electromagnetic pulse. The onboard electronics should fail outright. Meaning what? Engines will shut down? Everything will shut down. Engines included. Drive, navigation, communication systems. Remember, need Hellman alive, unharmed. Gotta try not to blow the AV to bits, okay? I know, but I'd say your man had best be buckled in. This idea, if it works, you'll be in for a rough landing. Aren't you, uh, counting chickens? We can't actually know the AV will fly over the station. Of course we can, but we don't have to. You'll see. It's bound to be quite a ride, but not one you'll regret. I've got everything planned out. All right, let's ride. Great, hop in. It's cold out here. Who owns this power station? Gov or Corp? Is there any difference? Who do you think pulls the government's strings? Hey, I'm just wondering whose toes we're about to step all over. V, look around. It is simple. Everything you see is owned by a corporation. You like to mess with the corpse, huh? Whatever gave you that idea. Or wait. Scratch that. Rogue, Nash, the Raffins. You're on thin ice, V. You just like to mess with everyone. Well, then I suppose it's a good thing I'm on your side, isn't it? Mm-hmm. And now for something completely different. Weirdest thing you've ever transported. Go. What? Are we playing 20 questions? Come on, answer. The deputy finance director of Kaukaz. That's chauffeuring, not smuggling. He rode in the trunk. Flatlined. Really? Dead? A long story. Maybe someday I'll tell you. We've almost reached the dam. We'll make a quick stop here. We need to calibrate you with a turret. I want you to be able to use the gun, too. It should up our chances in general. Connect here. Do we really have to waste our time on this? We do. Unless you've already used one of these without help, while moving, while taking fire from all directions, and still managed to hit something. But somehow, I don't believe that's the case. So don't argue. Just connect. How should I connect? Personal link? How else? Just watch the jack. Sometimes you have to jig a little bit. Wired in. Wait a moment. Diagnostics first. Shit, it keeps giving me an error. Odd. Let me work around it. And now, Pan Am, here's Johnny. Out in the middle of bumfuck nowhere. Great work, V. Hey, uh, I think your implant has a virus. The one in the nape of your neck. It's not a virus. Just a little... malware. You get used to it eventually. Screw you. Will it affect the calibration? We shall see. Okay. Here goes nothing. See that pile of junk? Fire a short burst into it. I'll take care of the calibration. Good. Next target. Single shot. Okay. Just one more. Longer round. We're done, I think. And that wasn't so bad, was it? Uh-huh. Just wondering how to work with moving targets. The gun is calibrated. You'll have system support. Just be careful with the recoil. It sometimes knocks things out of balance. So where's this power station? You will see in a moment. I know a spot. We'll have a decent view from there. I just want to be sure the area is clear. Sabotage a Corpo power station. Jump a Corpo transport. 
kidnap a corpo suit. This a plug for the word corpo, or do you have a point? Know what? You're starting to remind me of me. Fifty years back. Minus the charisma. An impressive cock. Hmm. Maybe we can just get along. Could be something to that, I suppose. What happened to us, it must have had some effect. You're more like me than you think. You'll see. But it goes both ways. Maybe you're becoming more like me. Nah, no way. All looks clear. The area looks deserted. I see no patrols. The huge thing is the collection unit. And see the antennas? Each antenna collects microwave energy from satellites in orbit. That's then converted into electric power. Huh. Antennas run all the way down the interstate. Mm-hmm. And they're linked, which is to your advantage. We just need to mess with the collection unit. A chain reaction will follow. Each one of the antennas will emit an EMP burst. The AV will be like a fly headed for a spider's web. We just have to fire off the pulse at the right moment. Let's go get her. Once we reach the station, I'll set up a bypass for the detonator. You just overload the systems. Overload the system? Yes, ma'am. When do I start? Though, hoping that's not too complicated. Is it? It shouldn't be. You just turn everything up as far as it'll go. Crank it up to 11. Got it. So what now? We wait. We should time our arrival to the AV flight. Got it. Good. Time to roll. Done anything like this before? Downing an AV? By myself? No. Why do you ask? Seems Rogue was right. V... What? She said you were good and she was right. Yes. I suppose she was. But we have yet to take the AV. So you might wait before you fasten a halo on her. Know what? I think I figured you out. Oh, you have, have you? Either pull off this mission or prove Rogue wrong. Choose one. Fuck off. I will get both done. Okay, we'll be there in a moment. One last time. We drive in, fuck up the system, and get the hell out of there. Hold on tight. This could get a little bumpy. Get ready. Okay, I'm ready. Girl, you wanted 11. You got 11. Fuck yeah! Let's get out of here. 
before it lights us up too. V, get the fuck out before something happens to the chip. Thanks for the tip. You know, I was just about to set up a picnic. Maybe lay out. Work on I my mean, base, Dan. Watch out. The next one might. Johnny? Johnny. Fucking hell. Okay. I'm fine. It's... It's okay, just... It's okay, I'm fine. Yeah. Just... Delta the fuck out. Not the cleanest job, perhaps, but it still went well. What about the detonator? Is it working? Yes, it's working. And I don't even see a drop in the signal strength. We just need to drive far away enough to keep the pulse from blasting us, too. The cliff there. We'll set up. It should give us a good view of the antennas. And then we wait. Okay. Here. Always wanted to push the big red button on something like this. How do we know when? Don't worry. I'll have eyes on it. You just wait for my signal, then set off that pulse. They won't know what hit them. And by the way... What? We are about to knock a multi-million euro dollar Kang Tao asset clean out of the sky. How does that make you feel? Blasting shit. Exactly what the doc ordered. And that's exactly what I like to hear. Just noticed. What? It's quiet. The hum of the city, people's voices, the smells. It's all gone. Wind just intensifies it. Think I forgot quiet exists. Mm-hmm. Though maybe not the smells. I mean, the coyotes. Rather hard to miss. Thought that was just the air freshener in your Thornton. Ha ha. Screw you. You'd do better to focus on the AV. Keep your eyes open. It's there. Coming from Pacifica. All right. Get ready. One more second. One more. Now! Boom. There she is. Shit! What's, What's going on? Great. Just great. Bullseye! Pan Am, the engines are still running. Fuck, they're getting away. They're going nowhere. We gotta go after it. Give me a moment. Pan Am, what are you doing? Altitude. We got the bastard. Let's go. We got it. No way it stays in the air after a blast like that. You either land or crash. You catch that? Over. AV on mark. Losing out. Fish. There. Scorpion. What the hell are they doing? Finishing up at the generators. Follow them. On my way in a bit. Battery Mitch, should sort Scorpion, itself out. It's Pan Am. Don't go near that AV. I repeat, do not approach the AV. <laughs> On the way, or I'll start the party without you. It's Kang Tao! Wait for me! Or better, get the hell out! They probably want to help the survivors, without knowing it's corporate. They can't hear me! The pulse is interfering! Shit! I have three on radar! Drones? Yes, get ready. They're trying to slow us down! We won't let them! We have to reach with the Scorpion!
For the time being, at least. Time being's all we need. Behind that hill. Well, one less thing to worry about. Ugh. Pan Am, you okay? A fucking ricochet. Think you can manage? Sure. I'll live. Don't worry. Hey, man, where are you? Hello? Mm -hmm. Perfect. Scorpion? Keep broadcasting over an open channel, just in case they missed you the first time. God, I swear. Something's not right. Did you hear those shots? V, something happened to them. Let's check it out. I see the wreck, but no Scorpion, or Mitch. Looks expired. Fuck it. <clears throat> v, connect to the drone. We'll scan the area. We have to get our bearings. Let's roll. You connecting to visual? Mm-hmm. V? If they got the Aldecaldus, if they got Mitch and Scorpion, I can't... I don't... I know, I know. Connected. I'm in control. Combat drones. Defense systems active. They secured the area. They're waiting for reinforcements. Shit. V, this does not look good. Got five Kangs on patrol. Launcher. They'll tear us to shreds if we get too close. Can we take it down somehow? Maybe. But we have to get there first. Oh, no, no, no. I'm, I'm sorry. If not for those damn glitches, I could have warned them. This is all my doing. Why in the hell were they following the AV? Probably keep the helmet in the AV. Mind that launcher. It will blow us to bits if we approach. Okay, here's the plan. You stay in the car, No, I... not so fast. I will go with you. Those are my people. Pan Am. Hate to break it to you, but you're hurt. Wait in the car. I'll try and take out the launcher. I... Fine. But I have Mitch's rifle. I will try to cover you from here. Good idea. Let's move.
Hell, I'm not able to shoot.
how to take yeah. thing out. That's clear. I'm coming for you. Too late for everyone to walk out of this alive. We called for backup! Bullshit! Last chance. You don't gotta die today. Let's talk. Why should I believe you? Pan Am. Shoot it up! Listen. Are you alright? Uh, just some scratches. You fucking morons! Did you get hit? Hang on. I'll pack you up. They regrouped so fast. Started shooting rockets and shit. I lost everyone. Everyone? Scorp? Is he here? Mitch? Mitch? He's... He's safe, right? Pan Am, I'm sorry. I didn't make it in time. No! No! Are you sure? No, he... Scorpion, the rest. I'm sorry we didn't get here sooner. They were good people. Great people. They didn't have to die here. I should have stopped him. I tried. He wouldn't have listened to you either. Never was much of a listener. Stubborn bastard. I'm guessing since you were out here, you were out here for the AV. The question is why? I need the guy who's riding this AV. You know anything, see anything. Took him with him. In our cars. Where? West. Small unit. Your passenger's entourage. Must be looking for a way to call base. So you're the ones who hit him with that EMP? Yeah, we tried to warn you, but... Couldn't connect. If they took your cars, we might be able to follow their tracks. Pan Am, listen. I know it's not the best time, but I need Hellman. He promised to help. That still hold? I always keep my word. Mitch. I will find those sons of bitches. I swear. Go. I'll call the crew. Get all this cleaned up. We'll leave my ride here just in case. Just watch the gun. It likes to jam. We'll go by bike. Sounds good. Kang Tao lost contact with their AV. Probably looking for it. Better hurry. Coming back with her, right? Let's get going. Before they set a rescue party. Scorpion and the rest. Look, I know how you feel. I mean it. I'll help you settle your score with Kang Tao. I will destroy them, V. Every last one. We're in this together. To the bitter end. You know what, V? You're all right. You help me with Nash, you help me with Mitch. To my mind, I owe you a favor. Your helmet. I will find him. Ah, so that's what this is? Just paying your debts? No. Nomads always help Oh, own. so I'm one of yours now. Sounds good. Let's ride. 
Hope they didn't go far. We'll see. The tire tracks start there. Ugh. We'll follow them. Our guys were here. Well, they don't see us. Let's follow. Find them. Scorpion said I would hate Night City. He knew you that well. Probably better than I know myself. He said when I'd had enough of the city, we would stock up on canned kibble, fill a couple of thermoses with coffee and whiskey, and hit the road. He said we would get away from it all. Sounds like a real adventure. Yeah. But he's a Shit. Why is everything shit, shit, shit? Hey, I know. Look. You're alive. We've got a few things to take care of, too. <laughs> All I see is cracked concrete and rust. But they thought they would call their friends. They were in for one hell of a surprise. Watch out! There's a sniper behind the van! Laser focus! Come on! Wipe them out, V! Impressive. There, I admit it. Taking helmet with me. Well, that's that. Better hurry then. That's one of our... one of their rides. Let's check it. Don't know if we'll find anything else here. Enough. There's nobody here. Better check where Kang Tao took him. Fast. Left a few peeps behind at the airstrip. Rest went with Hellman. I would have done the same. They're looking to call their people. The last they want is to ride through the desert without backup. I hope Mitch contacted the Alder Calder. All that damn interference. They're coming for him. Don't worry. You know what? What? This is my life right here. I step out of one pile of shit, only to trip into another bigger one. Pan Am. And pull in everyone else after me. I'm done. You hear me, Pete? I fuck up again. You better give me a good kick in the ass. But you didn't fuck any... Promise me! All right, I promise.
Hellhound filling station. I wager that's where they're holding help. Drones. Patrols. Definitely set up shop here. I see. They must have Hellman locked up somewhere. Buffy, see that? The pumps look pretty good. Not what you would find if the place... The bastards might have managed to call for transport. We'll know soon enough. Jeez, are you trying to make new tombs?
Nomad. I'm in. Yes, 
sent you? Hey, easy. We gotta talk. Who are you working for? You're Nobu Arasaka. Do you wish to take me back home? Pathetic rat's got nowhere left to scurry off. He's out of lifelines. Shut him up already. Not a fan, I take it. You haven't found a fan in him either. Motherfucker doesn't know who to be scared of more. You or Arasaka. Don't take this personally. I seem to recall you were gonna tell Takamura when you got Helmet. Yeah, just a sec. I'll call him. Just remember, you have Helmet, and that's one hell of a card. Try to win something with it. Takamura saved my life, remember? Because it was in his fucking interest to do so. Still just Biz. He's no friend of yours. Takamura, good news. Got Hellman. Alive? What did he say? Alive, alive. Not too talkative now. Taking him to the Sunset Motel. I will come to you. Keep him there until I arrive. You got it. See ya. Better take him somewhere you can talk in peace. True. Looks like your new Chimbas are here. Is that him? Sure is. Take him outside. Toss him on the bike. Stay right there. The cavalry has arrived. Mitch gathered together a few elder helmets. <clears throat> the road was clear. I don't think we were spotted. We would still do better not to hang around too long. What do you plan to do with him? Just gotta ask him a few important questions. I sure hope you get some important answers. Saul. Everything's done here. All clear. I heard Mitch is alive thanks to you. Thanks to V and Pan Am. They both saved my ass. I just hope he was worth it. That's all I tried to raise Scorpion. Maybe I could help out somehow? I think you've helped enough. I tried to stop him. Sure. Just turn around now. Let it all be damned. You're good at that, aren't you? Look, Saul. It really wasn't Pan Am's fault. Careful. You and me are not buddy-buddy. Besides, nobody's blamed anyone for anything yet. Sure. Right. Pan Am was just helping me. It was my doing. My fault that A.V. got hit. Without me, Scorpion and his people wouldn't have gone out to grab it. That's the truth. When you're in Aldo Caldo, you were always responsible for yourself and your people. The circumstances change nothing. Perhaps Pan Am should ask herself if she's still in Aldo Caldo. Damn it all! Hey, don't worry about Saul. He'll get over it. I don't give a damn. But he gives a damn about you, Pan Am. As soon as he heard what had happened, he ordered us to follow you. He was worried something would happen. Saul? That was his? Look, maybe you two don't see eye to eye at the moment, but your family and Saul will do anything for family. The thing is, am I even part of the family anymore? You know you are. Come back to us. <laughs> I understand. Sorry you had to witness that. Things just get complicated. Dramatic sometimes. But I will manage. And you, you look out for yourself, all right? Saul, Mitch, they really treat you like family. Maybe you should give them a chance. It is not that simple. Like any family. They're coming. You have about a minute to get out of there. Let's move! I'm also headed out. Take care of Scorpion's bike. It's yours.
Hey. Where am I? What is this place? I want to talk about your little invention. Biochip you made for Arisaka. Fine. But let's get one thing straight first. Yorinobu Arisaka didn't send you? No. This means you must have an offer for me. If your boss will pay more than Kang Tao, I believe we can talk. Nobody sent me. I got a problem, and you're gonna help me. And what does that have to do with the biochip? Your text trying to kill me. Pretty sure that's not how it's advertised. If you wish to file a complaint, I'll need more details. Got Johnny Silverhand's construct stuck in my head, and I don't want it there. Silverhand? Construct? That's impossible. Where did you get this biochip? Clepped it off Yorinobu Arasaka. Job for a client. But the client left me out And you decided the best place for it was in your own goddamn head. Actually, wasn't a bad idea. Construct rebooted me when my own goddamn head took a bullet. I always knew Yorinobu's plan would fail. I just never imagined it would turn out like this. Arisaka's prized tech really is in the very streets of the city. You have to remove the biochip from my system. It's not that simple. Look, you made the thing, didn't you? So where's the problem? If you're telling the truth, you slotted in a new experimental version of the biochip. How's the prototype version different? It's got a different engram, something more... Aware. Aggressive? The biochip is what's unique, not Silverhand's engram. The previous version of the chip was only used to communicate with pre-saved And it was rare as fuck and cost a fortune. Yeah. This one's rarer. Meant to install and activate the engram in a new body. When I left Arisaka, the project was still in the trial phase. How do you put a price on immortality? Who could even afford tech like this? Nobody. This model was meant to remain in-house. The prototype was Saburo Arisaka's personal commission. He oversaw the entire project himself. So if it weren't for Yorinobu, nobody would have found out. And if not for you, the project would not have been a success. This is a true breakthrough. How exactly was this new version supposed to work? Were you planning to have the engram kick people out of their own bodies? Is that shit by design? During the tests, we assumed that the body would be neurally indifferent during implantation. You mean dead? Yes, which makes what happened to you interesting indeed. Yeah, yeah, great. Your tech works. Now get it out of me. Well, well. I would have to see it first. Whoa, we just met. Haven't built up that sort of trust yet. How did you think this was going to go? If you want me to help you, I must examine you. Okay. Hmm. Unbelievable. It looks like... Can't believe this Zeus the one who's gonna help us. What? What is it? What a pity I won't be able to examine it fully. Yeah, real shame. You could have been his guinea pig too. Tell me how to get rid of it. I'm afraid I have bad news. Your neural network has completely deteriorated. It can no longer function independently of the chip. The only thing I could Woo do... Woohoo, it's bargaining time is to give you information on a good clinic in Sweden. They'll help you through the terminal stages. Minimize the pain. Wait, you said the project was in the trial phase. You don't actually know how it'll end. Oh, I do. I just saw the construct devouring your brain. It's programmed to take over its new environment. 
at all costs. And your little meat brain is helpless against it. So no matter what, sooner or later the engram wins. Yes. And from what I've heard about Silverhand, that seems to be exactly his style. Huh. I see my reputation's grown into Arasaka legend. What exactly is going on in my head? You tell me, what's it like to have two personalities? Because it's not like you're hearing voices. You are both yourself and Silverhand, simultaneously. I can see him and talk to him. You're not talking, but yes, I understand what you mean. Have you noticed the Construct's influence on your decision-making? Jeez, give it a rest. Mm -hmm. You will start doing things that were once unthinkable, at least to your old self. And you know exactly who he was. A fanatic. A terrorist. A suicide bomber. Well, fuck me. Who's trying to mess with your head now? That is why I believe it would be better for you to consider clinical isolation at this stage. At least Johnny never whored himself out like you. Are you defending him? Or is that Johnny speaking now? Oh, let me guess. He already tried to take over your body. You know, just for a little while. No. Would you, though? Could be fun. Johnny... Kidding. But watch out. Suit's getting ready to talk your head off. Know what? That's enough. You're just playing for time. Because I can't tell. Are you trying to convince me you're useless? So, I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Ah, oh, finally. I will try to help you, if you come with me to Kang Tao. Forget Kang Tao. Got any other ideas? If you think there's anyone else who can help you, I could give you the blueprints. Complete project documentation. Kang Tao offered quite the sum for it. You got it with you? He's got to. Gonk's fucking useless without him. He... Takamura? What the hell is he doing here? He's got a few questions of his own for you. You play nice, he might even save your ass. I'm almost done. The blueprints. Better than nothing. Long as we find someone fluent in techno babble. What will you do with him? I haven't decided yet. Are you serious? You know me. I can be impulsive. He's all yours. I'll give you two some space. I hope we can come to him. That is certainly in your best interest. V, I will remember this. Ah, this heat. My throat is positively parched. Yeah. What the? He did not give you any Fuck! I will accept that. Thank you, man. That is not me. I will give you two buckets. No. Sit down, goddammit! It's the damned ship. My silver handosis is clearly incubating. That appointed finger I hear in your voice? Fuck! That was your tickle. Sit and rest. Don't need your flat money while we got a job to do. Blah, blah, blah. Fuck Arasaka. Blah, blah. Smash Mikoshi. You really are turning into me. Can't say I'm excited, because you're a manipulator egotist and a cynic every time you open your mouth you gotta bury someone you know we get along as the need arises maybe it's time you started trusting me more every cell of my being dislikes you how can I trust you do I gotta remind you how this came about let's not get wound up you're not yourself
honestly can't fathom how you got so many people to bend over backwards for you. Don't. Come on. I know what's happening to me. The old V's gonna be a faded memory soon. Got no idea where I'm going. Be a living legend. That's all I wanted. Feels like I'm barely surviving. Test of a person's true value? Death. Facing it. Staring it down. You still got a chance to be somebody. Yeah, maybe. What was it like when you died? Was on top of the world. Failure not an option, not a thought. Till it happened. Death feels real now. It's only now I know it. Now? I had half a century to come to terms. Makoshi felt, I don't know. Like sleep? Lacked awareness. Had no sense of passing time. Didn't mark it. Did what they wanted to me. I just remember. Cold, a black void, fear. Or... Or was that your death? Well... I think I get why you detest the place. Shouldn't exist. Of all the destruction and pain corps wreak around the world, what happens at Makoshi is worst. Know why? Because you're trapped there forever. It's eternal. No, nothing's eternal. And for the psyches in Makoshi, no such thing as the passage of time. Worst things when they switch up your identity. And you never even know you've become someone else. Corps have already taken the world for their own. Now they're coming for us. Realize what you're doing to me is what our sock is doing at Makoshi. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm gonna fix it. Let's move. Get back to work. Let's do.